am so happy to hear that. You know what? And to celebrate, I've got something very special planned for you. Okay. <laughs> what was that? I scheduled your colonoscopy. <laughs> well, I hope he has better news for me than he had for you. <laughs> okay, Mr. Butler. I have the results from your physical, and... You know what? I'm fine. I don't care what your stupid test says. <laughs> Actually, they say you're in amazing health. Oh, well, tests don't lie. <laughs> I told you, he's a good doctor. You should have listened to him. <laughs> your cholesterol is good. Your blood pressure is low. All your numbers look great. Huh? Terrific. Now all we've got to do is schedule your colonoscopy. Uh, say what now? <laughs> your colonoscopy? When it comes to colon cancer, early detection can save your life. It's standard procedure for anyone over 45. Well, great. So there's no rush. I plan on being over 45 the rest of my life. <laughs> Look, I know the idea makes a lot of men uncomfortable, but trust me, it's not a big deal. First, you'll be put to sleep. Then we insert a small camera into the rectum. <laughs> From there, it travels through your large intestine. Then it zigs and it zags deeper and deeper all the way up here into your small intestine, taking pictures along the way. <laughs> then we just reel it back in, and out pops the camera. Well, it all sounds delightful, but um, it's a hard pass. Oh, hey, babe. So, what did the doctor say? Exactly what I told you he would. I'm in perfect health. You know, I hate to say it, but uh, I think I'm gonna outlive this one, too. Well, that is such a relief. Did he say anything else? Uh, no, no. Uh, not that I recall. I'm so happy to hear that. You know what? And to celebrate, I've got something very special planned for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's that? I scheduled your colonoscopy. <laughs> Let's say what now? The doctor's office called. How could you leave there without scheduling an appointment? Come on, Tina. The doctor said I was healthy. Isn't that good enough? No, Calvin, that is not good enough. You know, I looked it up online. Do you know that one in every 48 men will get colon cancer? And that number is even worse for black men. Well, you know what's worse for this black man? Is having someone turn my ass into a photo booth. <laughs> Calvin, this is non-negotiable. You're too important to me. So here. What's that? It's your dinner for tonight. It's a stimulant laxative that will flush out your system. Come on, quit playing. I don't want that stuff inside my body. Oh, don't worry, baby. It won't be for long. Welcome to the block. Welcome to the neighborhood. Welcome to the hood.